troll to help us. Cave. You need a lantern? Okay. We'll find one. Calm down? There's no calming him down. He gets on the path, he gets a semi, and then he can't stop. <laughs> Starberries framed a serene view. Shame about that buzzing beehive, though. Hmm. My love, you're my everything. I might not have enough money for a ring yet, but I just can't wait any longer. Will you be mine forever? I better put this back. Can I put the meat there? Someone had set the scene for a lovely evening. Bees! I ruined the bees' day. <laughs> that lovely meal. But I got this. I tucked the berries away for later, even though I was craving a cliffside snack. Whose who's meal did I screw with? Wow, that was a douche thing of me to do. Lordy those thighs. Yeah, that was a um, pretty good gift. Good gift. So now what do we have? We have starberries. We got meat from there. We have starberries. Um let's go see these this pumpkin. I don't know what I do with this. Or this guy picking the berries. That pumpkin was housing too many squirrels for my taste. I never waste food. That didn't need a bell. I never waste food. Do anything with this? Oh. I'll take that. Uh, like a berry picker. Fruit picker. I don't remember seeing any fruit to pick, though. Ah! Well, that did absolutely nothing. <laughs> okay, then. Uh, no, it's good, Jones. Not yet. I want to go into town and see what I can do. I know that this is the part that I got lost. I never made it into... No, wait. I did make it into the cave. I think you go with a Chaka, right? I walked into town with my last coin. Whatever path I chose to pursue for my eye would need to be cheap. Well, let's check out the black... Ah, let's check out the beggar first. I feel bad about this. Hopefully he's not too upset. Took you a long time to get the pumpkin? What does he want? Hello there, and good afternoon. If I do say so He's myself, got cupcakes. sometimes you roll the dice, and they all come up wenty. Even though the bridges are out, and my supplier has gone missing, I sold yesterday's bread when I wasn't even here. Oh, I wish more people were that trustworthy around Daventry. Now, that was me. Cabin, lad. How may I help you? That was me. Oh, hope you're hungry. Uh... What's today's special? <laughs> oh, well, today I am baking up quite the treat. Grandma's star shroom pie. A delicacy big enough to feed an army. Or someone with the appetite of an army. <laughs> I've eaten <laughs> it in one sitting before. Well, don't judge. Yeah, you can give me a tip. No one would trust a skinny baker, now would oh, they? Oh gosh, now I want a cupcake. Unfortunately, my ingredients haven't been delivered. But I can't complete the recipe. 
Until those bridges get fixed, people will just have to settle for the love in my go-to pie instead. But she was going to give so if you free can find rise. me some starberries and sugar shrooms, they probably can have this good mustache rides too. For the discounted you know, big price thing is one gold coin. Well, I have the star shroom. You need a horny Dave to get a pumpkin. <laughs> to get the pumpkin, you need a horny Dave. Got any free samples? Oh, today only. I'm letting people sample our new walnut strudel. However, I ran out of bitter root. It's really nasty on its own, but it really brings out the nutty flavor of the strudel. It usually grows under big, heavy rocks. If you can find me some, you can have all the free samples you want. Okay, well, I know where the big rock is. That's not a delicious, chocolate, hideous beast <laughs> okay. cake I smell okay, cooking, Jones. is it? Looking for an eye, are you? Well, it must be that time of year again. Frankly, I can't tolerate it. The Fays weren't raised that way. It's archaic! So much fighting and needless killing! Compassion comes from the heart, you know? As does food! If you want to get to the heart of any problem, all you need is pie! What about cupcakes? You look like a compassionate fella, uh, like myself. And I think we're going to get along right as raisins. Uh, please, don't <laughs> raisins. take part in the violence. Put a Jennifer Beals picture over it and you'll beat it to a pulp. <laughs> Odd. Good day. Don't get in any rhubarbs. Okay, well, I can have all the free samples I want. Sign red. Ask us about our free samples. Once I get that root. What was it? Bitter root or something? Anyway, I know where it is. I just gotta get the root somehow. And my inventory is full, so... Hmm. Let's go up to the... What? Like, the alchemist? Someone... Oh. Dear. <sighs> you on the delivery, boy, are you? That merchant is usually so prompt with our air, miraculous, and oftentimes delicious ingredients. Oh, horse feathers, Chester. This boy's no courier. He desires a position in King Edward's court. He appears to be a compassionate gentleman, but he is clearly out of his convent zone. He is one who needs to think more with his brain and less with his heart if he is going to defeat the contenders in this year's night tournament. Zounds! Did you just read my fortune? No, we we're just very old and very judgmental people. Oh, the inventory will expand? Judges. Okay, This good. is my judging face. Ariel and I don't read fortunes anymore. Yep, there was no future in it. Well, we've shifted our core business to potions, curiosities, and the occasional practical joke. <laughs> Uh, we gladly share our wisdom for free, but everything else starts at one shiny gold coin. Take a look around, boy. Let us know if you like anything you see. Uh, that guy looks like... Did you guys ever do the, the little project? You usually do it around Halloween. <sighs> Where you take an apple and you carve hey, into the apple and then let it dry out too. and then it looks like that guy's face. Or at least right. <laughs> it was quite handy around the shop though. Especially with potions. He'll return. He just has some adventures of his own to see. Something mysterious and magical was brewing in that pot. Ooh, what are these little guys? Those are bird bombs. Our own invention. Kinda like a smoke bomb, but they release gas that will cause your victim to cluck like a chicken. <laughs> Temporarily, of course. Those ones are expired, though, so they're just for display. It looked like some type of broken lantern. Hmm. It reminds me of our son. Talk to him again. <sighs> I always miss him this time of year. He dreamed of becoming a knight, too. 
I wish he would visit more. Or at least right. It was Did quite handy around the shop. Did you find everything you were looking for? Do you have any eyes of hideous beasts in stock? An eye, you say? Yes, yes. Uh, your name, please? Uh, it's Graham. Last name? Graham. 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 With a G, I assume. <laughs> I don't see your name on this list. Oh, you did pre-order, right? Uh, pre-order? Oh, yes, this time of year, our eyes fly off the shelves. If you haven't pre-ordered, you're out of luck. Our eyes are completely on back order. If you'd like, we can put you on the waiting list for our next shipment. When will that arrive? We get shipments every eight months. <laughs> I'm afraid that won't work. Well, hang on a sec. It's Graham, right? May we bend your ear for a bit? Bend away. You need an eye for the tournament, I'm guessing. Yes, I have always dreamed of becoming a knight. Why? With Daventry's addendums this and proclamations that, it seems a frightful business. Do you have any idea how many royal guards we lose to that voracious moat monster? Well, my father was a moat knight, monster. and my grandfather was a knight, and my great-grandfather, well, he was a dentist, but his father was a knight. Basically, I come from a long line of protecting crowns. I started looking for knight jobs while I was still in the academy, but once I graduated, all the opportunities had dried up. I might not fit in here, but Daventry's my last shot. Oh, you'll fit in just fine. It might be too late to capture the rule-defined eye of a hideous beast. But rules will bend for those who can outsmart the rule-makers. So... I've just gotta know, what is brewing in that cauldron? <laughs> is it a transfiguration elixir? Is it an invincibility potion? If I drink it, will I understand the language of creatures? Will I sprout the wings of an eagle? Or a fly? Oh, this? Teeth whitening potion. Oh, it's gonna change everything. Watch this. Behold the power of whitening! Oh! Oh, well. Oh, well. Oh, well. We're still working out the kinks. While we're still in the prototype phase, feel free to dip whatever you <laughs> want in water. there free of charge. Hmm. Ooh, how much for that candle? Our everlasting blue flame lantern? The housing's broken. Someone brought it in for repair but never paid. Tell you what, if you bring us something we can hollow out to house the candle, you can have it for the price of one shiny gold coin. Oh, so you can use the lantern to go into the cave. How's that teeth whitening potion coming? Well, we're still working on it. You can dip whatever you want in it for free. No guarantees it'll come out white, though. Should we? Let's dip something in Pretty it. Well, <laughs> may the brain be filled you with trying to knowledge. turn me into Barney, right? Looks like Barney the dinosaur blew a load on a sock. <laughs> Let's, uh. It reminds me of our son. <sighs> I always Can I throw the raw <laughs> meat in there? This will work great for dipping. Ta da! Okay. Raw meat that I dyed purple. How about. Interesting thought, but no. Go ahead and dunk it. Astounding! Everything's purple! Go ahead! <laughs> Maybe Astounding. this is a bad idea. <laughs> How'd the bell work on that? I know! Nice idea, Gwendolyn. <laughs> okay, everything's purple now. Fuck. Did I just screw up something? <laughs> Maybe those berries can be used for something, though. Hmm. Hey, Graham. If you like sharp things, <clears throat> you've come to the right place. We have over 23. Oh, forgive me. Last night was a little rough. I woke up on the floor. My bed nowhere to be found. Can you believe that? What type of Yahoo steals a bed while you're sleeping in it? And the most curious part... Nothing else is missing. Anyway, take a look around. Let me know if something piques your interest. Piques your interest, eh? 
You need the meat to lure Dave. <laughs> the meat sickle. You can post a work order on anything you want lifted, chopped, or crumbled. Then I'll bring out Mrs. Crumbler to fulfill the order. Oh. Oh. Don't touch that, Graham, or you might be the one losing an eye. But it looks so cool. Back away from the crumbler. Unless you have 50 gold coins for a work order. 50 gold coins? Ready for action? Do you have any idea where I can hunt down an eye of a hideous <laughs> beast? What a glorious day for a tournament. Catch the horn My dog favorite with the time of year. Meat. If I ride new recruits, the clanks and clinks of armor clashing, and the action the very finest. One hopeful always rises to the occasion. I love it all. Some people in town, they complain about the barbaric events, but it's a tradition I'm proud to be a part of. If I was competing, I'd go after the biggest, scariest beast I could find, even if it meant certain death. As they say, fortune favors the bold. You, on the other hand, have a kind heart. Probably wouldn't blind a beast just to win a competition. Your arms look like they've never even held a bow. No, you're just too nice. But perhaps you'll prove me wrong. So, I've been meaning to ask, what is that amazing blade for? Is it for battling vicious werebears? How many ice orcs has it slain? Does it deal justice? Is it road legal? Is it made of fear? <laughs> uh, oh, that? No, no, that's for gardening. I use it to trim my edges. <laughs> Seeing as my place us. is all tended to, and my petunias are most lovely, I'm willing to part with it for the price of one shiny gold coin. I'm sure you've got a prickly situation oh. that needs attending. Find a horny Dave in a bush. Okay, I think I'll I'll be able to find it. As soon as she said biggest, you're mindful with the rest in the rest of the sentence. Crossfit. <laughs> Bye. Hey, kid, can you do me a favor? I can try. Can you help me keep that back door closed? I run the local Wedzel Wolf Watch program here in town. There's patches getting made. If you keep that door closed, you can be an official member. Think it over. Patches. You didn't call me Patches, right? Okay, let's- oh, wait. Is it dusk now? Or is it the same time? Um... I never waste food. You poked? I did not poke that. That did- Okay. So- oh. That door is locked. We don't have to worry about it. Let's uh, go find that bush. To remember where the bush was, though. Mm. Oh, we also have the frogs. What's that bush? Shoot, I think Whisper was down here. I don't know how I'm gonna catch this frog Where if I can. I tried again, but it was no use. Um. No, I can't even do anything there anyway. Stupid. <laughs> okay, Dave. Have fun. Party hardy. Uh, be behave yourself, though. Happy New Year's. I think I just have to go back. I think it was back this way. That, uh, yeah, there's that bush. That didn't need a bell. You poked? No poking. Oh. The purple meat. Ew, gross. What is that? Wait, did I just... I just put him in my... Oh no, a nasty badger. <laughs> a 
Oh, he was humping that meat, wasn't he? Oh, gosh. Oh, jeez. <laughs> it's Horny Dave. Yep. He just humped that meat. And he's now... Is he purple now? Should I call... Should I try to dye him? <laughs> oh, gosh. That dirty little bastard. What am I gonna do with him? Uh Shoot. Well, the squirrels remember that? <laughs> the squirrels will most certainly remember that. Ah shit, that was a douchebag thing to do, man. This cape. <laughs> Dude, the cape is so cool. He's badgering the witness. <laughs> Over overruled, the witness is a badger. Oh no. So I just fucked up. I scared the squirrels away from their home. That particular motion is denied. Uh, now I have a pumpkin. Um, I have a pumpkin- wait, I have a pumpkin and starberries. Let's see if he wants these. The pumpkin pe can be- let's go die. I should have died the badger. Dude, now I kind of feel like a jerk though because I feel like my choices are going to matter in this game. This will work great for dipping. Go ahead and dunk it. <gasps> I can trade this in. Purple. Well, uh, yeah, ta -da. Here you go, boy. Can I trade this in for this? If I could bring the hobble pots something to hollow out and house that glowing blue candle, I could have that lantern for the price of one shiny gold coin, of course. So, I could take the lantern, or... Let me go back to the baker. I don't remember what he was going to offer me. A pie? Hey, Formidable. I'm doing good. How are you doing today? And Snake, how's it going? Happy New Year's Eve, guys. Save? You can't save. Yeah, you can't save. Ugh. What did you want to sell me? Want? I think he's... I think he tries to sell me a pie. How do I get my free sample? Well, bring me oh, some bitter roots. Root. It's what I need to finish my walnut strudel. It grows under big, heavy rocks. You think you have the flu? You got the flu shot in October, though? Yeah, that's why I don't get the flu shot. I think the, um, the strand changes every year, and they always give you the year before that strand. But I hope you feel better soon. I thought I had the flu yesterday, but I think I just had food poisoning. I ate a bad potato. Okay, what's the pie's ingredients? So, where can I find the ingredients are for the giant pie? Are you just uh, gonna be chilling at home tonight, Formidable? Coin. But, which ingredient? Wait. Never mind. So, where can I find the ingredients for that giant pie? I'll also need one gold coin. But, which ingredient? Oh. Well, I have the starberries. I think the last time I got the pie. And I went over to where the trolls are. Never mind. Good day. 
I want to go get those time. berry, uh, the roots from under that rock. Okay, Jones. Hey, Rain, how's it going? Snake and Rain, are you guys doing anything for uh, New Year's? Go find that rock real quick. See if we can get those roots. Mm. Yeah, that's how... That's how you get... Super, super sicknesses. Wait, oh... I'm gonna have to get him to help... I wasn't strong enough to move that rock. Can I use this? You poked? I did not poke that. That didn't need a bell. Wait. Can I ring a bell here? No. Mm -hmm. It's like I almost need him to help me move this. Yeah, work tomorrow, so no point doing anything besides playing video games. Uh, that's basically me. I, uh, I have to work in the morning, so... I have to say... I'm pretty impressed with the craftsmanship of these traps. How do we get to that trap, though? I feel like I just don't have enough options. Can I go ring my little bell by the horn? Okay, if I can't ring my little bell by that horn... <gasps> Maybe I can use a stick. Wait a minute. I've got that... this. Hmm. Let me go see the horn real quick, and then, if not, I'm just gonna... get the pie, or I'll get the... the pumpkin. Yeah, it's pretty... it's a pretty amusing game. Let's go to the horn real quick. Seeing all these new recruits makes me miss the old days. <clears throat> no, I went the wrong way. Attention. What? Wait. I'm lost. Oh no. Maybe streaming with the brother gonna play Wash Dogs? How are you liking the game? I dis is the first one, so... Uh, <laughs> I got the first one at midnight release, and I brought it back when GameStop opened again. Um... That didn't need a bell! You poked! I did not poke that! Pokes. Okay. Well... I tried. Let's go get the lantern. I haven't seen that. Go in the cave. The Skur Cave. You would say this is how the guy becomes a king? Yeah. He is not a knight yet. He's going to... We're trying to become a knight. We're, uh... We need to get the eye of a monster. Let's trade. Let's give our gold coin to them. How much for that candle? Do we have oh, a pumpkin? everlasting blue flame lantern? The housing's broken. If you bring us something we can hollow out to house the candle, you can have it for the price of one shiny gold coin. Okay, I want it. Ooh, how much for that candle? Oh, everlasting blue flame lantern? Oh, do I have to... The housing's broken. Do I have to present them the pumpkin? Bring us something we can hollow out to house the candle. You can have it for the price of one shiny gold coin. 
Fare thee well. May your shoes point you towards adventure and click whatever danger is near. Can I give you this pumpkin? Now, give us one shiny gold coin and the beautiful blue flame lantern will be all yours. What wisdom can we share today? Fare thee well. I had to. Your dang it, I had to. Be logic give them the coin and the pumpkin. Dang, this is. Here you go. So you spent your only coin to buy the lantern? I did. I figured that lantern would light an alternate path to find an eye. I'm so poor. Thanks, dearie. And here's your lovely pumpkin lantern with a glowing blue flame candle. Okay, now we have a purple lantern with a glowing blue candle. Let's go to that cave it now. Me of a mm. I'm, 